So where do you think our pit stop's going to be here? Uh, wherever I can drive this knife into people. Okay, got it. <laughs> wow. Uh, rated up for mature. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of PlayStation Underground. Uh, this is Tim, and I'm joined by a couple special guests here from Treyarch Studios. Uh, we have David Vonderhaar, and we have Miles Leslie. Hello, Hi. hello. Hey. How are you? We're doing great. Thanks for joining us. Thanks today. for letting yeah, us come up and play us. around. Uh, tell us about what you're doing with Operation Grand Heist in general when it, as it pertains to Blackout. What, right, so new? Operation Grand Heist got a lot of great stuff going on for Blackout fans. So first off, obviously, Ghost Town, which is a primary new destination. But beyond that, this map itself has had some significant work done on it in terms of the supporting structures or destination. So things that are not necessarily named on the map. Some are brand new. Some have been expanded. And what that does is give us more opportunities for more loot in more places, and that gets more important as we add uh, more game modes into the mix and we try various combinations of players. There's also a prestige system, so you're no longer capped at 80 star, as we call it, oh, or 81. Uh, and there's lots of quality of life improvements in the looting and inventory system in general, so you can pick up a weapon and swap the attachments against the gun that you're currently oh, nice. holding in real time. You can grab something and equip it immediately, so that includes medical supplies or a grenade. We like to grab the combat axe, you can throw it, and then you can pick it up again and throw it. Oh, awesome. Right, so that just speeds things along and makes... Uh, uh, a little bit easier to take inventory management and sort of work with those things. I love it. I, just like I love that jump. That was a great drop. See, he knows well, what he's well doing. Well managed. Let's we'll see how we do here. It's going to be a little bit more chaotic right. now. Potential collapse detected. Relocation to indicated safe zone is advised. Yeah, you oh, got going for buried. Far circle. Yeah. 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 So what Miles is doing right now is dropping into the the buried section. So the out, ghost town is made up of buried from zombies experience. And then it's also made up of outlaw or standoff from the MP experience. And uh, we normally don't co-mingle both of these sides of things together yeah. and put them in a way. And, you know, never in our history has there been any reason or excuse to actually take a zombies map oh. and then uh, throw it in with the multiplayer experience. And that's exactly what this does. And both of these areas are Western-themed towns, and that's about all they've had in common this entire time until they land as a primary new grand looting destination inside of the blackout. Yeah, and they, but they, they mesh together so, so well. Don't swap they? And swap and it, attach. Oh, that's great. Yeah. So you just hit triangle. Yeah, and so now he swapped um, all the attachments on the weapon he was holding with the one. I love that. Right, so uh, it's a just so, some simple things that you can do uh, to kind of help this along. And depending on which inventory settings he's using, um, can you look at your quick equip? Miles, we pull up the thing. Yeah, wait till he gets more than one of something, and I'll so show you. So you can see okay. it on the med the, the medical, but I need one more. And then yeah, yeah, okay. So yeah, yeah, we'll show you what we're talking about. Keep here. an eye out for some more med kits here. Uh, so one cool thing that I've, I've been loving uh, following on the ramp up to Operation Grand Heist is there's been, like, Easter eggs kind of... Oh, I heard some gunfire there. Oh. There's been some Easter eggs scattered around the Blackout map on the ramp up to the reveal of Ghost Town, right? Yeah, so a lot of fans, um, you know, actually... People actually did not pick up on it as quick as we thought it would. Uh, and But in the end, uh, by the time we got closer, it was starting to get some traction. So you would see sort of... El uh, here's a great place for nice. swap and attach, by the way, if he wants to hold his current gun. You know, no, so he just, just That's that. a tactical yeah, that he just tr tactical. told everything from. So anyway, sorry. Uh, what ends up happening with that is a lot of the supporting structural destinations around the map... We put down survey stakes, right, as an mm. indicator, you know, that if you were going to a brand new construction site. Pardon then, our dust type situation. Exactly. So that was a little teaser. And then actually where Ghost Town is on the map had some pretty literal call-out references to Buried, if you understood Buried and were a fan of that. There's so like the uh, the clock from Ghost Town, like that was originally hanging in the map. Was that one of the Easter eggs that was there? It, it was, yeah. The clock from Outlaw up above, we kind of buried in, which was kind of cool. Oh and right, the players yeah. Kind of stumbled upon, it, like, oh wait a minute here, and we actually put it in the location of that it was going to end, that it is now. That's uh, amazing. Which is kind of a nice little nod. I think when you're playing the game, uh, you know, you're trying to survive, so the last thing you're doing is staring at everything. Uh, but we have got all sorts of crazy little things going on, and the players do not catch all of them all the time. And uh, we're going to keep that up, so, you know, uh, shout out to the first person who finds what might be in the map right now. You'd never know. <laughs> You're going to have to jump in and find out. Yeah, I'm, I'm a sucker for that kind of thing, so keep up the oh, good work. I think you want that armor. I like nice. that. Yeah. Well, i got to get going here. Now, I want to see the Cosmic Silverback wearing oh. Ooh, level 3 grunt. armor. Oh, you want to see that? Yeah, let's see that's, it. That's a good call. Yeah. 
the cosmic silverback wearing level three armor. Ooh, that's man, just, that's just a big boy. He right was there. already a beefy boy. That's it? a beefy boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> beefy boy. <laughs> Uh, people are just going to put down their guns as soon as they see you. Honestly, <laughs> yeah, it's really I mean, intimidating. I kind of just want to go brawler. You know, I got circle problems here. I'm yeah. not going to lie to you. Yeah. How far is your uh, nearest vehicle? Oh, I or, hear, I hear. or you can just take that uh -oh. one. Uh oh, no, he's the, he's out of there. What is the origins of of the cosmic silverback? Where does this oh boy, this beautiful beefy boy come from? Where is that's, that's that's some zombie madness. It's great. <sighs> this is a. <laughs> This is a story that has uh, a deep heritage and tradition, and I'm not even sure how appropriate it would be to talk about. There is um, some uh, some friends of Treyarch who uh, this uh, the Cosmic Silverback uh, may be named after directly or indirectly. Okay, okay, we can keep it at that. Uh, <laughs> you know, people can research the mystery <laughs> on their own. Um, so you, I'm seeing now the the circle problems that you reference, is, which is yeah. like, you know, that's that's sort of the trade off. Uh, there was a lot of good loot to be had yeah, there, but you ended up on the fringe. A hundred percent. And I I'll be honest with you, is because uh, sometimes I'm so focused on loot uh, goblin. Uh, yeah, loot nut or trying to kill people. You were so that loot I goblin. I do terrible <laughs> uh, circle management, which is why I rely on everyone else in my squad to yell at me. What are you doing? Well, I also so selfishly that. asked you to focus on Ghost Town for so that's long, true. so it's, it's not your, playing it's one to fault. one it's your like fault. you would. You, you, well, that's absolutely not, my fault. That's not nice. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You need to. Your manners are poor. I apologize. Yeah, good. That's it's better. my own fault. Are there Take any? Ownership. Are there any other potential? Uh, so, are there any other potential blackout updates that we might see on the map as we're hoofing it over um, into the circle? Uh, I think you'd mentioned some other yeah, examples. He's, of the path he's on is not going to lead us through the the finest version of those things. Can you show me the map real quick, Miles? However, the circle management now. If he can find a vehicle, we can drive you right up to one. Yeah. So there's this is uh, this area did not specifically need any help. Oh my gosh. This is real life blackout. Yeah. You know, this is not. This is all of its. it's not this dirty. is what happens when I play with my squad too. I'm always going circle, circle, circle. And they're all still got the loot goblins. They're all still trying to kill somebody that's like four thousand yards behind us. I'm like, let's just go to the circle. Why do you? You got to. You got to be the adult in the situation. I'm which always, like, listen, this is great, but. It's like, I mean, I, well, the, need, need the squad that I here. play with has some real hardcore slayers on it, and they get super hyper aggressive on uh, how many kills can they put down in a single round. And I'm like, I like the win. Yeah. And uh, getting the most kills is not necessarily the key to victory. Yeah, because I mean, you can you can make it to the you know the top two just by avoiding contact for as long as possible. Well, you can. Yeah. I, I can. Yes. <laughs> I believe that's your primary principal play style, am I right? A hundred percent, yes. Yeah. Uh, but does, that does not result in a victory condition for No, me. not not so much for me uh, in, in go, Miles, previous so time. But grab the ATV and go. That's why we had to have you guys come in and just, you know, tell me what I'm doing wrong. Yeah. The, the randomness of the map that we've currently loaded has allowed us to uh, spend all of our time in Ghost Town to run across the rest of the map. That's yeah. great. Yeah. That does not make for great video capture. Yeah. You'll still have at least two hit points when you no, encounter someone. No, it'll be fine. You know, he did burn all of his health. Someone's going to sneeze on me. <laughs> yeah. Well, you have level three armor. I want no excuses. I want only victory okay. conditions. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's, th that's right. Supply drop inbound. It's just... No excuses. <laughs> You're still not oh, in the circle. Uh, is he uh, busted glass? Yeah. Oh, the ATV's parked there. Yeah, yeah. That's going to be a problem here. Yeah, that, well, not unless you eliminate them and take all of their health. I'm going to sweep the leg. <laughs> <laughs> sweep the leg. <laughs> uh. So what's your plan now? Let us inside of your okay. mind. Okay, uh, so right now I'm kind of freaking out. Um, <laughs> so <laughs> it's a little scary because I have no health, okay? Uh, I don't really want to burn my sensor dart, but I probably should. I'm also looking for health here. Yeah, and he's, someone's yeah, been through here, so they've probably yeah, got all just, the health. It's just straight looted it all. Yeah, so you're wasting your time. That's tough. So this is so this right. maybe maybe, maybe so get this, lucky. This Go. door is Sometime. closed, and that scares me. And yeah. oh, 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 man! man. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> so now what's going through my head is I'm totally screwed. Um, I don't know what to do. That, I've, I've that's blackout. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's blackout. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta add the hook. Welcome to blackout. <laughs> Someone left the door open for you. That's nice. Thank you. Yeah. Yep. And and this is why circle management is key. Yeah. Uh, I think he took my ATV. Yeah, he, he might have. You know, oh. the circle's right here, so it's okay. I really just, you know, just like one. Just one health somewhere. Yeah. No. No. Just the intensity is real, though. I'm drenched in sweat right now. <laughs> oh, that hello. was an explosion. 
<laughs> well, you know, I'm gonna roll up and someone's just gonna be sitting in a bathroom. <laughs> never. Because that never happens. It's not America. not a valid strategy. Do you guys have any other like preferred places? All things being created equal, like what place do you like to drop uh, most consistently? Well, the, the new support structure additions kind of fit my play style perfectly with my crew as we like to go right on the outside of okay. destinations. So, you know, there's a new one back there we call kind of the campsite behind the offices, uh, the behind Hydro that's I love personally. And I just love looting up these areas that are kind of, you know, on the edges and then working my way in. Oh, hello! A little inconspicuous. Oh. Just like a cosmic silverback. Oh, oh, he's oh. your... Oh, yeah. he's yours. Oh, he's going to oh. be a problem. Oh, oh he got oh. that gun. Oh, no. Yeah. You know, Get, you're getting the high ground? I don't know where he went. You wasted that dart. You know, so easy to armchair quarterback and blackout. I can just sit around and criticize him. It feels good. Play all day it's, long. Yeah. This is right. It's yeah. like, wow, that I'm was glad, a bad decision. I'm glad, I'm glad you guys are enjoying yourself here because I'm just. I'm <laughs> oh, someone on the roof. Oh, uh, yeah, shoot. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. That's okay. That's oh, okay. See, it's like we're actually playing yeah. right now. Like, yeah. We're in your squad okay. and we're like it's trying okay. to help you out. It's okay. It's okay. Only it's five okay. hit points left. It's okay. It's okay. I think if he looks at you funny, it's you're okay. going to die. Look, we're okay here. <laughs> no. Ready? No, Watch. you don't. You have no health. Don't worry about it. It's fine. <laughs> Run away. Okay, here's what's going through my head now. Um, you're going to die to the circle. You're going to die to the circle. No, no, no. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This you're is gonna die to the circle. Prone to victory. You're prone gonna to die. Victory. You're gonna die to the circle. Prone, prone to victory. You you prone have five victory. hit prone points. Don't worry about it. It's gonna be fine. We're gonna be okay. We have made it. The circle's okay. been waiting its entire existence <laughs> for this moment. Like, this is <laughs> the, circle. the circle does the, not care about collapse. me at all. Okay, don't worry. He won't hear me. <laughs> this is the slowest yeah. game in the history of Blackout. That's right. I mean, this has been great. We can always always jump into another one. Uh, I don't know what you mean. I'm going to win this. this is... No, that would be a fantastic <laughs> comeback story. <laughs> from it I, love, it? I love sliding with the... the... There it is. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Let's get back in there. Uh, uh, kill Cam, kill Cam, kill Cam. <sighs> I, we, must, we must watch... Him, him watch me oh. just... Oh, no way. That's okay, what he needed, okay. huh? Oh, why is that... Uh, why is that oh, he on? just... What? Oh, wait, what? Oh wow! This go. Oh, this wow. wasn't even the guy that was fighting. Me. Well, that's because all you had to do was sneeze at me. Oh, yeah, I see. There it is. I didn't hear those first couple shots. All right, we're jumping into one more match. We have succumbed to the the one more round the one uh, more. syndrome. Yeah. Uno mas. So feel free, uh, you know, Vaughn, jump into whatever you like, uh, whatever you f what makes you feel fancy we're here. We're gonna try something different here. We're gonna show you an area of the map that just didn't exist uh, yesterday, that exists today, which is a new supporting structure kind of place Miles can tell you all Perfect. about it while I try to land yeah, so of course because of course, we're actually playing on yes, the day that the Operation Grand Heist has, has launched so right. this is fresh for us Operation Grand Heist you know one of these things we've done is take a look at the entire blackout map and looked at the distribution of these supporting structures as we call them and we've added a few big ones uh, kind of at the corners uh, one at the top one at the bottom in the west, Vaughn's dropping to one right now. We kind of call this oh. the campsite. Great right. campsite to myself. And, it looks like. and this is really cool because it's behind what used to be kind of more of a hot drop uh, offices by Hydro. And this is really putting a lot of pressure on, on sort of the edges and squeezing it into the map. That's great. So those are the new ones we've done. And across the entire map, we've taken a look at all the support structures and uh, added more buildings, you know, and cover and other things to help leapfrog you from support structure to support structure in between the destinations so that you always have some space to loot uh, and get to as well. Awesome. Yeah, this is these are the, the areas I like to land in so that I can actually, you know, fool myself into thinking I might run win around every now and again. That was the whole reason we, we added them. So Thank you so much. Thank you're you. welcome. Psychological. Yeah. It's funny, though, because we did, uh, when we first started, you know, we do everything on paper, and we had a, you know, we call these one sheets, and we had all these support structures, and we actually went super ham. Like we, we thought there was too much, and we're like, ah, oh, okay, let's let's pare it down. And we pared it down, and then through playing and you know retail and and just looking at everything, we actually brought a lot of it back because, like you said, having these buildings and these spaces actually really good. Yeah, definitely, and it's just like they're they're so discreet that I feel like you know it doesn't. Um, it doesn't pull in, you it know, doesn't hurt. your average player, yeah. and and so you feel smart for having chosen like the, you know, the outskirts, yeah. a slightly less flashy area to to go check out.
I think for as well, and this is for me personally, is I, I get attached to kind of a route, yeah. which is, you know, and I feel it's like a personal thing where I'm like, all right, we're going to go gas station and then we're going to go bricks, you know, all these random names that you have. Your squad comes your up squad. with nicknames yeah, for, absolutely. for right. your, your favorite spots. And now you have more of these opportunities. You're like, all right, we're going to go campsite, then we're going to go check offices, and then we can rotate from hydro or we can go down to train. It's one of my right. favorite things about working on Blackout is half the stuff that has a name wasn't something that was named. Like no. the, the design document for this didn't necessarily say anything or whatever the name ends up being because of whatever people called it just ends up being that way. And it's kind of the fun thing. Like it's it's what is that? It's the campsite. Yeah. It, will that stick? I don't know, right? Does it matter? Yeah. Not remotely. But like the fans own it. Like yeah. it, I think that's a really interesting kind of thing that happens as a result of working on something like this with so much stuff in it. It's a lot of fun. You know, a perfect example for that is uh, one is obviously the offices, but even if you go to MP, you know, way to the map fringe from BO3, people called the White House Grandma's House. Okay. Uh, that was the name of it. We d uh, uh, we did not name it Grandma's House, but that's what it's known. I and wish we could tra track back that etymology. <laughs> we, I want to know. What's funny is we actually put that building, you know, parts of fringe are in Blackout across Rivertown. So we've sprinkled that throughout as well and preserved some of those engagements as well from MP. I love that. Uh, so, Mr. Vonderhaar, yes, sir. let us inside your head a little bit. What's what's your plan? Is just get, getting all the good stuff and working your way towards the more popular Yeah, so I, I actually have a little bit of a ways to go. So I bounced out of okay. uh, this section, and I'm doing the loot and go. So as I run by things, I'm on my way to the circle. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm still looking for a, a, a 5.56 five, uh, gun, not because I have a 7.62. I mean, this is technically a 5.56 five, gun, but the grav does not have any attachment capabilities. Uh, and uh, it's a great gun for people with better gun skill than me. So I don't have my optimal loadout quite yet. Got I'm it. happy with my armor. I have decent equipment. I'm not happy with my attachment situation, and I'm definitely, definitely not happy with my health situation. I have no med kits. It sounds like uh, a lot of no, excuses. No try. <laughs> I've heard you actually you know, don't have to I just, I just, I just am hearing a lot of setup here to getting killed. I just, I don't know. I've read online that actually you don't have to worry about health kits if you don't take any damage. Ooh, so you could a, try that strategy. That's a pro strat. You know, the, he actually has the grav, right? And, uh, or the, the sorry, the, the, what's your secondary gun? I, I have a rampart and a grav. Oh, okay, yeah. Is we pulled out some of the zombie guns and put them out in the world now. Yeah. So like the MP40 and these other ones that you can't actually put any attachments on are just out in the world. That's another change in the oh in that's the great operation, which is cool because now you get the opportunity to use these really unique guns outside of the outside the of the other. And, and since there's no customization, again, it's one of those choices: is do I just take that gun as it is, or do I try to take something else? Mm. Another change to the guns we did, and Vaughn kind of mentioned this before, is LMGs now do almost double damage to vehicles, which is really cool. Oh, okay. So that will incentivize Ooh, you to pick tempting, them up tempting, tempting. outside of, you know, trying to shoot players is shooting down vehicles ahead of sort of the hot pursuit stuff coming out later this week. Ah. It's a vehicle game mode as well. Could be pretty cool. Yeah. Can you talk a little bit more about hot pursuit? Yeah, Hot Pursuit. Vaughn, do you want to try to go into that while you're playing? No, yeah, go for it. I'll, you okay. start, and yeah. I'll uh, provide color commentary. So, <laughs> so Hot Pursuit's pretty cool. It's a game mode where so we got the new muscle car, and basically bad guys can go into these this muscle car to try to get away, and when you're in the muscle car, you can see all the stashes on the map, and the goal is to get to these stashes and get the loot that's inside of them. The money. Oh, you're getting a shot. Ooh, yeah, company. Yeah, where? Behind. Behind. Might have been from the... Oh, yeah, oh. From the mountain side of the guy. Oh, whoa, ouch, 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 ouch. And then the police vehicles, if you get in them and you turn on the sirens, which are super loud, you actually get like a mini sensor dart around your vehicle, which oh. is pretty cool. But the trade-off there is that people can hear you, mm -hmm. right? So it's like you can use that and, and try to get near buildings and see if people are in there. And it's basically cat and mouse switching between. That's a, you know, it's pretty fun. Yeah, it's a fun like thematic, but also just mechanical like addition to the formula, and fits with like the sort of cops and robbers yeah, vibe. Yeah, hundred percent. That's great. It's really fun because you get people trying to be super sneaky, where they're like, they turn on a like a siren, they're like bleep bleep bleep, and then they they're like they turn it off, and they're like, I heard you. You're not gonna be sneaky. <laughs> it's the loudest siren ever. So a good example. I mean, Operation Grand Heist does have a very cops and robbers theme to it. That's why you see cop cars and muscle cars. It's why. Uh, the, both MP maps have thematic elements that are directly 100% sort of related to the cops and robbers sort of theme. And it's fun for us to think about yeah. uh, developing content around, you know, sort of this 
broad stroke sort of mesh bo- mine, mesh bo- mine. Border- borderline. Thank you. Sorry, I was t- he was he was getting into it. Oh, oh, man. I started to, to pick up what on Vaughn's saying Thanks. so he doesn't die. <laughs> Good I don't call. Because I, I, I don't want to this bad. I don't want to hear team. that. You know, it's just a tag team. It's just a straight tag <laughs> team here. Is uh, we've ne- we haven't done this before. We have these themes, right? Like last game and heading into this game is these thematical operations really allow this wrapper where it's another layer of thinking about the content. And it's expected. really engaged the team to though. challenge, to try to reach out. Right? Hey, we're going to do you know, cops and robbers and this grand heist idea. What's some cool I- ideas we can do across the spectrum of all the different game modes, uh, Black at an MP, to really a- sort of lean into that you know, and own that. And I think we've captured it, like Vaughn said, and it's really fun uh, for the team. And I think the, the players are really going to enjoy it. Yeah, you chose a really good theme to, to sort of rally around, like the sort of, you know, reminded of like 70s heist <laughs> movies a bit, yeah. and really, really great. It's fun with all the different skins as well, like the, the new, like, specialist outfits and stuff like that. Uh, you know, there's like cop ones as well for Ruin, and he looks like the old, like, chips, you know, motorcycle that's great. cop. Uh, oh, I love that, because, you know, there is the uh, a new multiplayer map that's the casino, yeah. Casino, yeah. It's over the top. Whenever whenever those outfits come in, we always get a good laugh in the studio as well because then everyone picks them and you're just playing against five different Elvises. <laughs> well, I know, uh, <laughs> well, I know we, saw, we saw several Cosmic Silverbacks in the staging area too just uh, just posing for each other, <laughs> which a is beautiful a beautiful mo- moment. Oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, oh no, he's oh, behind oh, you. Oh, you want to go screwed. forward? No, but, oh, I believe in you. I, I believe in you. I, I, I believe, I believe in you. Oh. Eliminate all other players. All right, so we said it. We said last match was <laughs> yeah, one we, more match. Anyway, this is this is our this our last match. We're, we're going to go in for one more. Uno um, mas. And we may see where people are dropping here, but we, we may actually go right into Ghost Town. We're go- we're Slow it down. Look around. We're going to survey. There you go. Oh, there yeah. you go. There oh. you go. Now it's on. Okay. Everyone got the memo. Oh, my oh gosh. look at that. Look at the new That's streamers great. in there with the green. Okay. See, now that I went we slow, go. this is just... Now, you gotta get a oh, whole building to yourself. The church looks fairly. Oh, no. No, uh, don't occupied. land there. Okay, Rotate. abort, abort <laughs> mission, abort. <laughs> yeah, okay, let's that. hope there's something in here. If not, <laughs> I'm gonna pick up a rock. <laughs> Vaughn, how come you haven't allowed me to pick up rocks? Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. okay. Be good. Be we good. can make this work. We're just gonna take all of this and we're gonna knife people as well. Okay, we're gonna mobility and skulker it up. Oh, man. That's good. That's good. That's a. But you need to stop okay. being so wimpy and okay. just land in there and get a gun, man. I mean, I don't know why you have to, like, abort entirely. I mean, I'm just trying to get good footage fun. I mean, really, that's all it's for. <laughs> it's like, He's getting a good establishing yeah, shot of Ghost really Town as he runs up here. It's really good. Um, I have good. Oh, someone okay. could be in the church. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hello. Uh, uh, he has, no, oh, he has yeah. no idea. He has no idea. He has no idea. Oh, there's two, though, two. Oh, oh, no! no. no. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Not like this. No, run, run, run! He's behind you! Uh. That was amazing. Oh. That was amazing. That was, a that really was amazing. Good I don't know what to do. The adrenaline is pumping. My hands are shaking. I don't know what to but do. But check your circle because you don't okay. want circle management problems. I don't, I'll knife this circle. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> the collapse. Knife the collapse. <laughs> it's just, I will stand at the wall. This yep. window's broken. All right, this is clear. Okay. The, what? Window. Window. Wait, oh, you changed it from tactical. Oh, that's... Sorry. <sighs> oh, did. Yeah. Well, he has to play with the regular normal controller that most people play with. Yeah, yeah it's it's actually unacceptable. All right, we'll change it. it. It's freaking me out. I mean, you know, the only reason we leave this in here is because you would cry if I took it out. I'm this just kidding. True. It's not true. You and lots of other people. All right, you got one one kill under your belt. Okay. I have a, I have a feeling that I need you to kill more people here. Sixty-seven other people. <laughs> are then, you up to it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Always. These are all yours. Oh, okay. There you okay. go. You know what? I'm gonna keep the knife. Cause... Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh yeah. Let's do. Something. I mean, it's lucky now. I mean, come on. You don't want that scope? No, I don't like scopes. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's 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 abnormal. Well. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh. Well done. Oh. Okay. okay. Man, that hurt. Okay. Is he raging in your mic? Uh, he did not. Yeah. That guy just, he heard about Ghost Town and how cool it was, and he just <laughs> wanted to check it out. Oh. Oh. You're so insane. Check your map, dude. You might have a long run. Please stop yelling at me. <laughs> trying to help you. Okay. I'm trying to help you. Why are we whispering? Because you said don't yell at you. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to try. I'm really nervous. <laughs> <laughs> this is, this is my, my hands are actually fully drenched. There's no pressure to perform. Yeah, this is... I, di- please, I didn't choose please. a streamer life. The streamer life chose me, I guess. Would you please check your map? You're okay. stressing me out. Give it just a little tap. Okay, just... A, 
Oh, oh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the zoom out. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, boys. Uh, <laughs> this is circle management. Next level. Circle management. Here we go. Circle here we go. Management. Here we go. Here we go. You know what? You cannot win the game without circle management. <sighs> and I am no. the best tactician in the game. I feel like I I I, I went to school. And Vaughn is my teacher in, in circle management. I'm failing. It's a tough one, you know. It's you know. We had a pop quiz today, and I'm failing. Pop quiz, kids. It's, it's uh, circle management. The, what do you do? The student pupil relationship is uh, takes time to develop. Yeah, we're going on almost uh, ten years. Yeah, 10, 14 <laughs> years. You look into office like hours as well. It's <laughs> yes. really underutilized. <laughs> So where do you think our pit stop is going to be here? Uh, wherever I can drive this knife into people. Okay, got it. <laughs> wow. Uh, rated M for mature. Got my head on a swivel. A vehicle would be nice too. A vehicle I feel like. would be nice. Oh, okay, this is no. this has been pilfered. This is no. this is this is how bad things happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I shouldn't I shouldn't even stop. No, I don't, I don't know even know why you're stopping. stopping. See, but I self-realized, right? So, so hmm. some of those lessons are kicking in. Self. -realized. I just felt felt Vaughn uh, you know, yelling at me I, in my brain. I don't actually yell. He just talks loudly. It's I different. I use my uh, broadcasting. Oh, okay. Okay. oh, I see. Oh, okay. wait. Oh. Oh. oh, hello. Oh, 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 oh you're gonna a, get uh, in, buddy. Oh, oh you're gonna get in. Oh, shh, shh. Go say hello. Oh. Okay. Well, good for you. So it seems like he has a gun as well. <laughs> <laughs> Confirmed. Uh, oh, you got two, uh, don't you? No. We're solos. Uh, no, I know, but I thought I saw a guy below. Okay. I'll just take it and go. Whoa. Beautiful. See you later. Yeah. I mean, sometimes survival's, you know, the most... Oh, uh, again, again, we, again. Dodge, again. Dodge. That was, that was Vonderhaar, little angel on my shoulders. <laughs> Get out. Run away. <laughs> See? Circle management. You can say what you want. No, I'm being serious. I know, sometimes. I really wanted to go knife him, but... I know. The little but Vonderhaar then you get goblins, and then you die to the blue. The restraint you displayed there is really mature. You know, I know what? I, you know what? I think you graduated <laughs> today, son. <laughs> it's been a long time coming. <laughs> Vaughn just handed me a diploma. Just <laughs> you, can't, you, know, you can't see this. The calligraphy is great. Uh, so I, actually, I actually want to turn around and kill him now. Yeah, I'm I struggling do. internally. Yeah, but if you try to run him over, he's going to destroy you with his LMG. This is true. Okay. Okay, but that's not how you drive. Okay, don't worry. Those, We're doing style really cool. points. Okay. We're doing style All right, points. Yeah, for your sophomore year, it will be... Uh, <laughs> no, learn the, how to drive. Learn how to drive school. <laughs> One thing at a time, sensei. <laughs> <laughs> so where are we headed? Uh, you know what? I hadn't really thought about that. <laughs> so we're gonna go to asylum now. We're just, we're just great. We're well, just, I mean that's perfect, you know, because since you're the cosmic you got buried yeah. is yes. part of Ghost Town, so you can connect with the other, you know, sort of zombies part of uh, of the Blackout map. That's great. Zombies are life, and it's interesting because they're actually dead. <laughs> <laughs> buried is the best zombies map of all time. Don't at me. Oh, man. The gorilla just makes too much noise. It always cracks me up. People want to be, uh, like, Reaper, the robot, or the gorilla. And it's like, well, if you hear a gorilla and no one in your squad is yeah. a gorilla, then you know <laughs> someone's nearby. So it's like it's basically giving yourself away. You know, life's about trade-offs, though. So sometimes you just got to be a noisy gorilla or a robot. And the most popular cool. characters in Blackout are actually the Blackout characters, which gives me great, great That's, hope for humanity. Is that true? Love. Yeah, no, it's a true story. I, I looked it up. That. Yeah, true story. Uh, scary zombies. So here's the uh, swap and attach. I love the SWAT. Yeah, do you? Yeah, I do. Well, you're the only one. <laughs> no, I'm, just, I'm just kidding. It's actually a <laughs> super popular yeah. weapon. I'm joking. I'm joking. It's Jokes. just it's really fun to use. Yeah. Are you are you able to name a couple of the more popular uh, blackout characters? Drop. Oh yeah, drop some stats, Vaughn. I already dropped the stat. Was that the only we need, stat we need you're a dropping? New, we need a new stat. Okay, Vaughn, what am I doing here? Sen uh, sensei circle. Well, you're too good to run the circle edge like us uh, weaker players. So it's important for you to kind of run towards the middle. Okay. Uh, and then get into a fight. Okay. And then get at least five or six kills. Okay. Mm. Or you can turn in your resignation. Okay. okay I good. have it ready I'm, back I'm, home. <laughs> You've had it ready every day since we started working <laughs> together. Just waiting. Just in case. You never know. Break, break glass. Uh, break glass. <laughs> and we have that recorded oh. if you need to reference Thank that at you. any point. I appreciate that. All you're right. all witness. All right. Well, sorry, so, sorry uh, Tim. We're, we're, we're getting a little carried away. So something we can tell you or help you with? Uh, what, where <laughs> He's like, nah, I, I want to so. know what you would be doing if you had yeah, the control Vaughn, right now. What, what would you be Mr. doing? Because I, I feel like I'm failing you. No, I want, you, great. No, I want you to do center, center line circle and uh, get in the thick of it. Okay. Now, I, I, okay. So first up, well, part go. of the fun is, is comparing strategies, yeah, I now think. For, for real, if, uh, if I'm playing in this scenario, and, and if I'm solo especially, but even if I'm quad, so it depends on which group I'm running with. My PlayStation team is super, super aggressive. 
right? Uh, and I have to just basically try to keep up with him all the time. Yeah, you're looking good there. I like until the late game, right? And and depending on if we're quads or not, I I do what they call circle edge. I oh nice. That's gonna be handy. Oh, you're doing good. Hello. Oh, hello, life. He's so I like to run the edge of the circle. So as the collapse is coming, I'm basically trying to keep the combat in front of me. You all saw what happened earlier if I get my back turned, right? I don't have the gun skill to spin on people. So I'm trying to control my field of view. I'm trying to make sure that the fight is most likely going to be in front of me mm. and that I create that fight, meaning I see them, I come into their view, not they come up on me. So that's a strategy that I play because I, I'm just so, well, I'm old. Let's be honest. <laughs> I like how you're... Uh, no, no. You're, yeah. pl you're playing to your strengths. Yeah, right. That's right. You should always uh, manage your strengths. He's a veteran so, is, I think, yeah. a better way to say well, it. What would you, you say? Uh, what did you call uh, us earlier? Old guard. Old guard. We yeah. are old guard, right? So I, I think it's a... But this is the great thing about Blackout. Like, you can win and not necessarily be the the best gun. It helps. It, I mean, don't get me wrong. The, the guys with amazing aim are going to do great. Uh, but you can also win with smarts, uh, you can win with loadout, you can win with strategy, you can win with tactics. Uh, and it's not just about who can uh, pull the trigger on the other guy quicker quicker than the other one, right? And I've, we've won games by outsmarting opponents, uh, and that feels good. Yeah. That, it feels good to, to put that experience. It's like, that's why I was, always why I was a search and destroy fan in multiplayer. Cause I, you know, it's like I felt like I could win because I could outthink the opposition. Uh, and, you know, do I go left, do I go right? Uh, so... Me, I'm running the circle edge. It's kind of what Miles is doing right now. He's kind of keeping the circle to his back. He's taking advantage of the unlooted territory in front of him. And when you do that, no one can come in behind you, or they cannot come in behind you as easily. And if they do, it's kind of your own fault for not checking your backside. That's a great perspective because it makes me feel like there's hope um, on my side. There for... is hope. Let me tell you about something we actually did for folks like you inside this with the merit system overhaul. So uh, we did, with the prestige system, we also changed the way the merits work. So... Uh, basically, the 50% of all players are going to get, quote, paid out, end quote, uh, for playing. So that uh, if you don't, f you, you will receive merits now for having positions that weren't necessarily top 5 or top 10 or top 15. Especially in solo and especially in, in quads or duos, sorry, duos. And so now we'll give more merits uh, for folks who are, you know, doing well without doing really well. So that people, you can feel like you can advance in the progression system. And that doesn't necessarily make the rich richer in that case because it's pushing it down, whereas the players at the top are sort of earning what they've always earned. Okay. Uh, and then the other side of that, which I was pretty cool, is we have in this particular version uh, sort of expanded the way the merit pool works. Everything gets multiplied by about 10. So it still takes the same length of time to level up as it always has. But the big difference here is you now... Uh, have the opportunity to award more merits for more things more often. Okay. So a kill used to be worth one merit. Now it's oh. Kill used to be worth one merit, but now it's worth ten, right? So things worth a hundred should be worth a thousand. That kind of scenario gives us the opportunity to create new opportunities for to award merits and and find new ways to help you level besides just kills and placements, which is the prime. Well, kills, placements, and challenges. By the way, everybody, make sure you're looking at your challenge pages. I think a lot of people leave a lot of merits on the table. Uh, I was. Uh, two pickup items away from a lot of merits uh, recently until I went back and checked it. That's a very fast way to level up the pickup. Oh, do do your there. homework. So we just got some, some gunfire from the west, it looks, was it? It looks like the far house. There's a helicopter yeah. landing here. So this guy might have set up shop. Had the same idea I, I had is go to the far edge. Okay. All right. Um, some banging. Hearing some banging happen. So right. he knows you're here somewhere. Um, but but uh, what what he doesn't know is I got this. Yeah. <laughs> you should repair your armor though. I mean, I'm just trying to help, not micromanage. <sighs> Heavy sigh. How is your How is your armor doing? And, and also, like, you, sh okay. you should equip the other health pack. I mean, I'm not trying to armchair quarterback or <laughs> micromanage. I'm just saying these are opportunities for you to be more successful, and okay. I, my job is to make you successful. Okay. Thank you. So right, you're welcome. Well, also, you really should have a scope, but we're gonna leave that one you off know, the table. Let's <laughs> <laughs> Just thank, having fun. Th thank you for your feedback. <laughs> I'm going to file that. So are you going to steal the helicopter? You know what? Now uh. that you said that, the answer is yes. <clears throat> okay, great. Just for fun? Where's it? I, I mean, like, they're just giving it away, basically. Like, yeah, yeah, but there's, there's no point in taking it. There's, there's so much noise. Oh, yeah. Okay. So that guy's a camper. And yeah. Miles, Miles, see, Miles see, loves campers. I don't, I don't like this guy. You know, he's he's rubbing me the wrong way, sitting in this this wherever he's sitting. He's gonna sit in the bathroom. Yeah, he's gonna sit in the bathroom. Guess what? 
the monkey's here to play. Oh, man. The monkey is here to play. Miles is the master uh, okay. at reading where the mini-map is. Okay, first. Oh, he's oh, up there. there. I, saw, I saw that man. Yeah! He wasn't expecting the Cosmic he might, Silverback. He might, he might jump outside. That's what I would do. Yeah. That's, that's what he would do. Try to come in behind Get him. inside their head. Is he going for the helicopter? No. There oh, you heard, you called it. Or he's just breaking glass. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's all. Nice. Nice kill, Miles. Thank you. Well done. Oh, look at all that beautiful oh, health. Just, oh, my thank gosh. You. Yes. Thank you, Mace. Thank so, you, so this is a classic hoarding situation. Check the second tab. Yeah, so thank you for collecting all this for me. <laughs> you know, I really appreciate it. This is a new system oh, you brought yeah, in where people actually, just give uh, it to you now. See the, gr see the gray here <laughs> on the on this uh, thing? This, this, this is, is actually yeah, it's actually one of the quality of life improvements here where if you look at the gray thing, it just means you're already maxed out on the ah. ammo type, so you understand there's yeah. no point okay, in taking I, it. I'm, I'm freaking out just sitting there while you're talking about it. I forgot to mention that earlier. Yeah. Okay, well that felt pretty good. All right, there's only uh, 13 left in this game. Miles, it also looked good. I just it, wanted to thank mention. You. Yeah, I appreciate yeah. That. So now yeah. you have good footage. And now this house is yours. You own it legally, so yeah. that's <laughs> yeah, the, the deed has yeah. been signed. Possession is nine tests. Yeah. Um, right. Miles, can I see the map real quick, please? Yes, yes, please. Hold. Let me. So there's a draft. <laughs> I'm I'm neurotic about that too. I'm I'm really happy that you okay, closed that this, door. Uh, yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. So oh, oh. <laughs> about thirty percent of this uh, final this circle right here is, is actually out of the map. So yeah, well, so it's it was, just open uh, land. Yeah, now. see that open land behind that border. So. This is we actually expanded the map boundaries so that the map is uh, sort of more shaped in a more consistent way and give us room to experiment. It was actually kind of fun to run along the fence line or bounce back and forth between it, but then you'd be out of bounds. So we actually pushed the boundary on this side of the map back from the fence so that you can actually use the map boundaries as cover objects, which is not something we... Do you hear that? I do hear that. Yep. Yep. Just trying to... Well, you're talking to us about literally pushing the boundaries, which is exciting. <laughs> but I, I also do hear... Figuratively. Yeah. And no, I, I don't want to make sure. It's hard. Not, it's hard to hear enough the game as it is. In yeah, the I don't. I don't feel good sitting here. I have to be honest with you guys. Yeah, I don't know. You're I'm not. So this isn't your style. No, yeah, I'm getting thing. antsy. I want. I want to go. You hunt. should do it. You know, you, you're you're doing great, bro. Okay. It's all you. Eight left, but I also don't have uh, good weapons to be wide open. No. Uh, I'm gonna go to these houses down here. Okay. This is probably oh, hello. Oh, oh man. man. Miles, that was a great Miles, game, sir. Way to go, sir. I, I thought you had that. Way Honestly, that was, that was incredibly let's, let's well just, done. Let's just edit the end and say I won. Yeah, let's put in a, a number one. Place. Yes, awesome. We Photoshop a one. <laughs> oh, we can, <laughs> we'll all handle it in post. <laughs> okay. uh, Miles and David, thank you so much. Uh, thank you. So, yeah, Operation Grand Heist is out there now. Um, quickly, besides the improvements and updates to Blackout, what else can people get in Operation Yeah, Grand so for, on the MP side of things, we got two brand new maps. We got Casino and Lockup, which are pretty awesome very different experiences with those we also have one in the chamber right now it's a new game mode that's out brought that back uh, fans have been asking for that we also have new specialist outrider and she's got some really cool stuff overall and then also out now is league play which players have been asking for i know it's taken a little bit but we wanted to make sure we had all the the bits in it well gentlemen thank you for stopping over from from treyarch studios so that's operation grand heist the blackout mode as it appears on playstation 4 there's lots of other good uh updates in Operation Grand Heist. And that's another episode of PlayStation Underground. Thanks again uh, to the gentleman from Treyarch for checking out the, the new updates with us. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you for having us. Thank you. That was fun, guys. PlayStation.